So John went for the fin value with the tens. Leo calls with the aces, and we lose John. Oh, and what's away. happened here? What's happened here? Whoa! We've got and on and on and on and. What's happening? And him, what are you doing? What are you doing? Under the gun open from Stevie Warbs. Warbs has opened under the gun. Ali has shipped the lot in with the 10 5 off. What's he doing? What is going on? It's a 1.8 million chip pot. It's for nearly a third of the chips in play of the tournament. Ali Malou goes for the rip for 88 bigs. We 10 5 off. Oh, here we go. Imagine. Oh, here we go. No. Yeah, it just can't. It can't happen. No. Steve has Somebody got a lunch. sweat. Steve has got a sweat. Six on the turn. Imagine if this comes a king. This might be highlight real history. Stevie Warbs fading a four outer. And he does. It's the deuce of spades. Sorry, guys. We missed the start of the hand because we went to John Adelaide. It went open under the gun. Steve Warbutton folds to Ali Malou in the big blind. I'm all in for 88 big blinds. I've got aces. I call what you got. Ten five off. <laughs> 10-5 off? Where have you found that from? <laughs> Ali Malou, 88 big blind shove, gun versus big blind, 10-5 off. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Tell them Warbs sent you. <laughs> and Stevie Warbs with 1.8 million between a quarter and a third of the chips in play. Ali Malou's already at the cash desk. He doesn't even need to wait for the count. Oh my god. 10-5 off. I think he might have just been getting sick of Warbs opening all the time and Warbs actually had the aces and 178 bigs at this stage of the tournament. Stevie Warbs pole position to take this down.